people like so Cloud can destroy Meta Knight's disadvantage really well because he doesn't move in the air basically. Yeah, he's poor aerial mobility and up air is big. But like, you get dash attacked and man, you get taken for a ride, especially as Cloud. Yeah, I can definitely see that. Especially like if you limit, just makes it easier to combo. Which okay, you there. which is what you want to have because you don't want to get gimped. Yeah, true. Like, true. Meta Knight having five jumps is like. Yeah, terrifying. the edge guarding has got to be rough for sure. It's terrifying. And D2 Day is definitely very good at this matchup. He has yes. a very solid record against Diabeo. Um, I don't know how he does against you. You probably go Mega Man. I go Mega time, Man. Right? Yeah. I've, I've never gone Cloud oh, Rushing. Gotcha. Is he going to die? He's not dead yet. Not yet. But a lot of damage. Oh, no punish on the forward tilt. What you doing? I think he wasn't sure because of the platform. <gasps> Let's not kill him. Oh. But it's still, yeah, I guess it's not worth it if it doesn't kill. It only does 1% still. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's see him land now. That's one way down. That's pretty smart, actually. Let's go, Derek. D2 Day is a smart cookie. It also has, like, deceptively low lag. It, yeah, if you don't swing, it has, like, no lag at all. It's crazy. No, it, it depends on the height, too, you do yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's really weird. Did, did Better Knight also just beat Cloud down here? I, I looked away, but that sounds pretty silly. Holy. Wow, that back there definitely would have killed. Oh, ooh, good, good tech. DI. Yeah, good tech, too. That didn't punish. That's, he's that's spot dodged. Kill. Yeah. He spot dodged, but going to get hit by the He was next expecting a grab. Person. Yeah. Man, take the grab. It's Cloud. I need to take my own advice. Huh? I need to take my own advice. I would have spot dodged there, too. Same, but, like, I see the same thing. Yeah. It just sucks because then you get put at ledge versus Cloud. Yeah, but, you know, better than dying. Yeah. Speaking of dying, D2DA going to take uh, Death Star's first stock now. I don't know about the air dodge, but I guess he's not going to get punished for it. Good punish on the Mock Tornado. Takes yeah. 11%. Like, that's not bad, considering the reward it would have gotten for the yeah. Tornado. And, like, they're both at really low percent right now anyways, so, you know, nothing's really going to ruin your day at the moment. Yeah. Ooh, this could be tough for Death Star, though. Oh, he still has his double jump. Oh, good air dodge. Oh, but then he gets footstool. All right, he makes it back. Oh, that must have been so scary. I'm telling you, this is it's so scary. Da -dun, like, da -dun, da -dun, da -dun. like you usually want to not have limit so you can use cross slash in neutral, but uh -huh. then you get gimped. Yeah. But D two D is at death percent right now to cross slash at ledge. Imagine if when Cloud had limit, he could choose to use the non limit versions by doing like by tapping the button as opposed to like holding the button. Holding. Ooh, Kinda I would like, love that. Like um, like uh, like Ryu tilts, I guess. I would love that. That would be broken. It would be broken. I think that would actually make Cloud the best character in the game. I think he'd be better than Bayonetta if he could do that. It would actually give him a ground game. <laughs> yeah. When he With has limit. limit. When yeah. he has limit, it would actually give him a ground game. But he's dead. <gasps> Ooh. D2 is saying no ground game for you. You're going up in the air. Oh, D2 messed up. He tried to finish it. He tried to, to make the game screen come up while he was invisible. Invisible, yeah. But he missed it because he sucks. No, I'm just kidding. He just wants game one. Yeah, man. He's... In, he's He's in loser semis. Loser semis. Already guaranteed money. There's money guaranteed. Top four today. No. Jordan, I'm sorry, Mork. <laughs> I should have gone cloud game one. I'm a fool. It's a learning experience. It's all good. All right. Money match him for all he's worth. Take his house, Morpheus. I already knew to go cloud usually versus Death Star specifically, but I was feeling myself tonight. Yeah. No, you. you no. I was going to say you're playing good today, but you like consistently play good every week. So. Never again am I letting this happen. <laughs> It was a He's learning experience. The learning experience is worth more than the 20 bucks the loser of this will make, or whatever. Hey, man. That would have been a, a little nice free point. Yeah. And some food. You get free entry fee anyways. Yeah. <laughs> Which I can't stop forgetting about. There it is again. Up tilt beating Cloud down air. That's crazy. That is crazy. That butter knife. The move is surprisingly big, but I didn't think it was going to beat out Cloud down air. Yeah, because that move is not surprisingly big. Ooh, he went for that forward air. Looking like Samsora out here. <laughs> and he is just doing tech in place jab. He could have forward smashed that. No. Really? No, he was in the middle of getting up and roll. I feel like if he did it immediately, because he kind of hesitated before he forward tilted. It would have to, like, I'm not even sure that would punish, but, like, if it would, it'd probably have to be, like, frame perfect. Because cross slash has, like, practically yeah. no lag. Yeah. Nice, shove loop back to stage. I hate when I get hit by that. DGA loves that. He just Good block. It oh, it's shield poked. poked! Oh my god, that's the lamest way to die ever. 
Yeah. Okay, well, maybe not, but it's definitely up there. It's one of them. Wait, what do you think is lamer? Um... My problem isn't I can't think of anything. My problem is like 10 different things just jumps into my head and I don't want to derail the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> Most of them involve... Oh. Most of them involve a lot of rage. <laughs> well, you, you mean you don't like telling me... You don't like getting grabbed that 60 by Robin with rage? No. Is that what I would kill? I don't like losing because I was winning. Yeah. And that's why I stopped playing this game. Ooh, nice. So speaking of losing because he was winning, these are, uh, Death Star has a very nice percent lead right now, but giving Meta Knight Rage is definitely very scary. Plus, Def uh, Death Star has limit now, which means he's going to be easier to combo. Probably Dash Tack will kill around like 40-ish, I'll say. Oh, never mind. This does it. That was, I think that was a reaction to the roll. I think that was really good from Death Star. That'd be kind of hard to react to. Meta Knight's roll's pretty fast. It is. I think, but also D2GA pushed another button after. Like, I don't think that was a real punish. Oh, obviously it wasn't a true punish, but. Yeah. I think D2GA tried to dash attack after rolling or something and just got caught by the cross slash. Death Star doing his patented wrist exercises, making sure he's got those uh, limit uh, climb hazards on deck. Oh my god, we're going to Battlefield. Has D2GA's counter pick? Interesting. What do you think about this? This counter pick? Uh, on D2DA's side. I don't, I don't really think I agree with it. This is normally like a very good cloud stage. And a very bad Meta Knight stage. Yeah, it's gonna... Meta Knight's ladder combo is not going to consistently kill, at least without rage. At like reasonable percent. And Cloud will be able to just spam the jump button at ledge and get to a, pal a yeah. platform. Yeah, and it's gonna also make it uh, landing harder for D2DA because uh, Cloud can just hide underneath the platforms and up air through them. So we'll see. I feel like I have this trend where every time I say that someone Oh my made god, a... he's dead, though. Never mind. No, Battlefield. Battlefield. I was going to say, every time I say someone made a bad stage counter pick, they end up winning. So I like can't talk about that anymore. Because <laughs> I'm just always wrong. Did you think that when Chocolate took me to FD? No, because you guys both like FD a lot. Okay. Chocolate's been getting super good at um, the footstool combos. And those are like best on FD, so I could understand that. And then you took him back, and I was like, well, Morpheus loves FD, and Mega Man's super good there, so that makes sense, too. That's a limit burn. I like how Death Star didn't even try to get to ledge. He tried to hit D2DA with the up B. Yeah, no, he wants to hit you. He doesn't care. I love it. Like, I'm still Ooh, shook. Ooh, baited. Wow. And he's dead. I'm still shook when he did back throw, run off, limit, cross slash off, off stage versus me. Yeah, oh my that god. That scared me. Yeah, he's letting you know, dude. He's psycho. He'll do anything. He is a psychopath with Cloud. I was fearing for my life off stage versus Cloud, which I usually don't do. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, nice landing tornado. That's a nice lot of damage. Twenty-three percent. Mm. Big back air. Actually, you know, the more I think about it, because I just remembered Ooh. this is a best of five. Uh huh. Maybe this isn't such a bad pick for D2DA because he's probably just getting out, getting the stage out of the way. But on his counter pick, I feel like he may as well get it out of the way on, uh, as for uh, Death Star's counter pick. Yeah, but if Death Star happens to win this game, oh, oh my god! Like if Death Star were, were to win this game and DT Day wins game four, then he could just ban Lilat, and there's no triplats or Lilat allowed. True, true. I was, I was just thinking about that. That's super. Is you think DT Day is that smart? Oh, I you mean, think Death Star's that? Oh, one percent. Right? Uh, technically, two percent because bubble. <laughs> Oh no, he just dash attacks, man. I feel like he's not that smart. I don't know. Maybe I'm reading too much into it, but like that makes sense to me at least. That's that's a big brain play right there. DTDA that's also just, just like, like big confidence. Like I know I'll win on my counter pick game four. So let me see if I can win on my worst stage. True. I don't know. That's just me being weird. Ooh, catches him out of the dash. The Death Star special. Good early up B. And you are dead. Don't unplug. It's know. not over yet. It's three out of five. Death Star, three out of five. <laughs> he didn't even realize. DTJ shaking his head too. He's like, man, I'm about to get robbed with this set, aren't I? <laughs>
Now, we've been doing three out of five inverses in loser semis for a while, as long as we get more than 20 entrants. That's the that's the bar I set. Give me 20 entrants, and I'll give you guys the three out of five loser semis that everyone keeps asking for. It's a for. pretty low bar. It, it is, right? Like, I don't ask for much. I'm not a demanding mayor. Yeah. Uh, will you run it back? Or go Lila or Town? I don't know. FD. Huh. That's an interesting pick. I mean, DTGA won on his quote unquote bad counter pick. Because that always happens with me. Maybe Death Star will win on his quote unquote bad counter pick. Maybe. Oh, okay. He made it out. If he died to that, I was like, okay, that's not likely. <laughs> I mean, no, I kind of like this because Meta Knight's going to have a really hard time landing. They're both going to have a hard time landing. Meta Knight's really fast on the ground. Yeah, but Cloud got down there still. I mean... Meta Knight has, like, nothing. I guess he has, he has dimensional cape. Ooh, missing the footstool combo. Yeah, like, FD's a scary stage to take Meta Knight to. Because, like, he doesn't have any platform to extend off of, but, like, if you get caught in the air at, or at ledge, it's a struggle. Because he's so fast. Yeah. It's not going to kill yet. <gasps> Ooh. Kind of looked like it would, actually. Nah. That was spooky. Limits, limits the homeboy. Limit is the homeboy. Ooh. Max based F tilt. Gets the pivot grab. I thought he was just going to go down there with down air. I wouldn't be surprised. Right? Like, it's Death Star, dude. He's crazy. He'll do anything. He's coming for you. He's coming for you. Blade beam at ledge right now. I'm surprised he didn't do it, actually. <laughs> he was That's, like, not even a bad option. He was oh, setting up for there's it. There's the blade beam. He's swinging. Death Star is swinging this big sword. I don't even think dash attack up you will kill now. Not yet. Nah. Like, so... The most... Oh, It'll kill if you're dodge. dodge. Not even. All right, he needs to... Whoops. Wow, he, thought he, had to... he thought he had a jump, I think. I think he did have a jump. He just went too low. Oh, that's going to even up that's the stock the Death super Star quick, special. though. That is a Death Star special. Yep. Turn around. Uh, forward smash. Good punish on the jab. Morpheus for top five human in SFL. It's fair. I would agree with that. Yo, let's go Cosmo. Thanks, man. Yo, we got more fans in the house. Oh, gets the back air. That's the limit. Ooh, good top dodge. Small punish. Shield. Oh, we tried to end him. I feel like if Death Star is going to go and for positioning, oh. good jump air dodge. Yeah, smart. I feel like if Death Star is going to go for positioning in center stage with his throws, I feel like he should be doing up throw instead. Yeah. Like I can it's see that. really slow in the air. You can juggle with up airs and like yeah. just force the situation to make them like, go to ledge. Like that's the reason you pick FD right? and charge limit. Like that's the thing I'm noticing. He's not getting much charge out of limit when he goes get these back throws and forth throws. Oh, rolls into forward oh, smash. Oh, he held that way too. Oh, DDA hitting him with yeah. the jank. Is it really jank if it works all the time though? It still it looks jank. It looks jank. No, actually, it looks pretty cool. 